Hi and welcome. I didn't find on the internet a very good video on how to flash or recover your Lumia phone. So I thought I may make up one of my own. So there's two things you need. You have to download and install Nokia Care Suite, not the newest one, because that does not include anymore the Care Suite external login option. And so I use version 12.4.4 and it works great and then you need Nokia data package manager and you can take the newest version you will find it if you google you will find the both of them easily so you install them and then you run the program data manager which should be in the Nokia Care Suite folder and data package manager. You, can, you should launch it individually, then it will work better. Then you log in to the Care Suite external. And wait. Then basically all you have to do is I have a Lumia 820, so I put in the product type, which is RM825 and a product code which you will find on the internet various files I have a Swedish phone now and I want to make it Finnish so I will you should use the use the 059 R O 0 B 4 and search and here it is you can see it's the Finnish variant of the phone. I already downloaded it because otherwise this would be a two hour video so it's already downloaded but it's the same thing if you flash a for example a Lumia 920 just RM820 and we'll put as an example 059 Four eight. Let's see. And there you have a Lumia version. It's software version is five nine six two thirteen fourteen. So it's the newer version. And it seems to be the America ATT Black version. But anyways, I have the eight twenty, so I use the the previous one. Then when you download it, you have to go and make a folder in program data, which is a hidden folder for the most. You have to make all your folders visible, and then go to program data Nokia packages. And here you make a folder named products, and in that a folder of your phone version, as in my case, the Lumia 820, which is RM825. And here all the downloaded files will appear. And then that's what you do with the data package manager. Then you go to the you can close this one now and go to the Nokia Care Suite. Program files Nokia Care Suite and application launcher and launch the application. I will use the recovery method because the refurbish method will only work if you are upgrading your phone. I will only change the whole firmware version of my phone. So double click on product support tool and log into Care Suite external. And this will not be on the newest version of Nokia Suite, so don't download the newest. I have heard also that the 13.4.4 would work. take some time to launch and there you go so now if I connect my phone here there it 
it's connected. And it will be found there. But now what you do is you press on the, the automatic product selection away. And you can take off the phone for a moment. And it should say no connection. Connect it back. And, and you'll find it yourself from open product and then you'll just find your own phone here 820 it is somewhere so we'll just type it and open then you choose programming and recovery. It will not. It will not. It will not find the package that you have downloaded into the products folder. And then you just press start. Now it will say. It won't work now because I have my phone turned on. So I'll switch it off now. As you see. We'll just wait. It vibrated. It's just said okay, it doesn't matter. Just press start again. And now it says you should press volume down and the power button until you it vibrates. Now it vibrates and press retry. It says you have chosen not to assi assign product code for this device. Do you wish to continue? Yes, it doesn't matter. You can always go back to your old project code later if you want to. You can always download it as a save some on your computer. And there you go, it started. Whatever you do, don't connect off the USB or shut down your computer. This will also work if you have a bricked phone or it doesn't go on. You can use this and you can get it back to life. And now we'll just wait. I'll put it down for a moment. You can probably go get a coffee or something. As we wait. Sorry for my bad English. But maybe you'll figure out something from the video, so... There is practically everything you need to do for any Windows phone. That's Salumia. And you can only recover or refurbish a authentic a Nokia signed product or a firmware. It does not allow any custom ROMs yet to be put on the phone. is a fast way and you will find all the product codes on the internet there's a lot of them for all models even the 925 seems to have already a couple of versions online so the steps are download and install Nokia care suit 
12.4.4, that's a good one. And data package manager. Then just download the firmware into your product folder in program data, which is a hidden folder. And then just run the product support tool for store. And you'll be good to go. I have done this like 10 times on this phone now and I haven't bricked my phone yet. I'm sure it would happen if the USB plugin would get out or your computer would say stop in the middle of something but still it has it has worked every time. It's okay, so it's now it seems to be so it will be ready. It says recovery completed. You can just close it. We'll just wait. It will take some time to some time to start up, but it shouldn't take more than three minutes. Well, we can take off the USB, it doesn't have to be plugged in anymore. Don't be scared if it gets laxed still, it will get on. Yeah, like that. There you go. All set, all done. And it works with... Just be sure you have the right product card for your phone. And that's all. Thank you.